Hey everyone, Darkball here, and welcome back to Game Destroyers TV. So, we're back in Farmer's Almanac, and we are going to continue gathering in these bales. And seeing what havoc we can cause building the haystack. So, while we're getting started, if you are new here, why not hit that subscribe button? We put out tons of content every day, and not all of it's farming simulator related. So, check it out. And if you're watching on an embedded video, same reason, come over and check us out. We have lots for you. And while you're at it, hit the notifications, that way you'll be kept up to date whenever we release a new video. So, the farm. As I say, we're collecting the bales here. And we've got a guy busy cultivating one of the fields. Uh, we harvested earlier, so it can get ready to be seeded today. And it's just going to be a case of slowly working our way through, getting everything kind of cleared up and ready for the springtime. So we can start harvesting again. And just keeping us busy. Yeah, another couple of bales yet. And we will be fully loaded. I don't remember, I think it'll take two more. I think. We'll soon find out. Yeah, it will. It will. There we go. Now we're fully loaded. Let's get back down here. I'll just go out this way, it's easier. And quicker. And hopefully this time when they offload they won't go tumbling all over the place. Like the last load did. I also gotta get a silage machine so we can cut more silage and I'm also looking at buying a couple of these fields. I was selling off all the stuff we harvested there, so we're gonna have plenty of stuff to do this winter day. Whoa! Sliding. Okay, back up to speed. Which is gonna be awkward because we're pulling a load up a hill, so a little bit slow going. It's not going to take us that long to get this field all cleared out, and then we will, I believe we'll sell our crops we got. Uh, I'll probably do a montage video of that, it's easier. Uh, it doesn't bore you guys the same. So, let us offload these, I'll let you see them. Uh, go tumbling all over the place as I offload them. I'm not trying to be too perfect with the stacking of them but they actually stayed stayed put which is surprising. I'm expecting them to go all tumbling all over the ground. Okay, now the table is down and... You're really not gonna... Ah, there it goes. It finally folded. Good God, that took forever. The round baler one folds up a lot quicker than that does. Okay. We're getting kept busy with the farm anyway as it stands. And then through here, okay, we're gonna have a lot of silage by the time these all lifted, which is good. It's the battle plan. As much as possible. But yeah, we've also got to buy the cattle. This uh 
today and uh, probably buy some pigs as well and that'll give us po uh, another source of income coming in for the farm I'll head up here and start along this back top row and get the bales off of it so but between the round bales and these square ones we're gonna have plenty to use for cattle which is good I'm not sure if you need them for the pigs I've not actually bought pigs before so I know they both need water so I'll have to look into solutions for that as we go The farm is certainly coming together now. A lot better than I anticipated to start with anyway. Which is good. Okay. There we go. This hard turn here. Grab these along this edge here. That one and this one here, and that'll be as loaded again. So we're not that many bales to go now. We've got a couple of loads, I'm thinking, and that'll be us. So, oh, well and good. We're gonna have the bales lifted before the rain starts or the snow I should say, or hail or whatever it is they're going to give us so all well and good I wonder if course play, I doubt it, but I was wondering if course play could pick up the the bales might be able to, I'll have to check that out if it can or not Okay, up we come. Nice and steady. And we're back to the farm again. Get these offloaded. Set these ones in side the, the last lot I did, I think. Looks like a good place to put them. Where you see them fall over. Not to be annoying. And they're still falling over them in the original stack. Okay. Well, let's just keep moving. Let's say the tail is being lowered. Please wait. Nope, I'm getting on the road. You're gonna be slow all you like. I really could do with folding in when it's pulling that uh, those pieces back. It should really just fold up as well. Because it's not in the road or the table or anything. So, I'm not sure why it does that that way. Okay. Time to get the rest of these bales. One. And two. And while it's doing that, I'm going to turn this way. And I'm turn back the way on myself, and that'll put us onto this roll here. And allow us to. Get everything collected that we need. Oh. That would help if I wasn't 
pushing the bales along in front of me. Got to love bailing. Anyone has worked with bales before, <laughs> you know what I'm. How ironic I'm being when I say that. Picking these things up and throwing them. Well, not this size of ones, but the the old school square bales, the ones they used to do all the time before all the bigger baling machines came out. We used to throw them, I have to throw them about by hand a lot of the times. Keep you busy. Certainly wear you out. Climb up on the stack, throw them down, get them onto the trailer, take them to use for feed or bedding, whatever. All the fun of the farm. Okay, well, I'm going to end this video here, and I will be back again tomorrow with another one. So, until then, everyone, stay safe.